all praise. You owe God thanks. You owe glory unto God because your sustenance is at the instance of God. I've shared many times how that a number of years ago I was, you know, I was, I had to go to a hospital to pray for a little boy, a, a, a teenager. And as I went into that hospital room, I saw from his body, blood being drained out of his body into a machine. And from that machine, blood going back into his body. And I asked, what's going on? He doesn't have the ability to put oxygen inside his blood. So they must take that blood from his body and oxygenate it. And then send it back into his body. And that's the only way he will be able to stay alive. And she said, this process costs 9,000 pounds every week. 9,000 pounds every week to oxygenate the blood of an individual. Now, in the very same room where this boy was going through that procedure, I was standing, I was standing, the mother was standing, another pastor was standing with me, three of us, and we were freely taking oxygen in and breathing it out. It was not the lack of oxygen that that boy was suffering from. It was the fact that we were assisted by God to carry out a process that he needed physical assistance to carry it out. Now hear this. I came out from that experience with this statement. Man is too, ex man is too, expensive, too, ex man is too expensive to be maintained by man. Can you imagine if oxygen costs 9,000 pounds to sustain a week? How about your kidney? How about your liver? How about your heart? Everything that is working within you, only one person is keeping it at work. And his name is Jehovah, the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords, the one who is...